Hi, I'm Simon with AppliancePartsPros.com. Today we're going to show you how to repair your appliance. Are you ready? Remember, anytime you work on your appliance, make sure it's unplugged or the circuit breakers are off so there's no chance of electrocution. In this video, we'll show you how to replace the Whirlpool Every Drop Ice and Water Refrigerator Filter 1 in a Kenmore refrigerator. It's going to be a very easy repair. should only take a minute or two to show you how to do it. When you open up the package, you're going to get a new Whirlpool Every Drop Ice and Refrigerator Water Filter 1. This water filter is located at the bottom of the refrigerator, mounted through the grill. It's designed to clean water by reducing chlorine taste as well as most known tap water contaminants. The filter should be replaced according to the manufacturer's recommendations. To get to the part, we need to open the freezer door. So here we are at the bottom of the freezer. We're going to open that uh, filter door. Mechanism pulls out the filter. I'm going to pull on the filter out and remove it completely. This is the old Whirlpool Every Drop Ice in the Refrigerator Water Filter 1 next to the new one. If you don't have this part, you can get it from AppliancePartsPros.com. All right, guys and girls, before we install this new filter, we need to remove this protective cap. Simply slide it off. Now I'm going to install the new filter. It goes in this way. Push it in. The door starts closing and then just push in the filter door and until it closes. Now we can close the freezer door. Plug the fridge back in and make sure it's cooling. Place the cup and uh, drain at least five to six cups of water before you start using it. Now after we replace the filter, we need to reset the timer. So I'm going to open the fresh food door. So what we have here is the water filter status light. If it's red, and it, it should have been red because we replaced the filter, we need to reset the timer. If you read the instructions, it says here, push switch five times within 10 seconds to reset water filter status. That's what we're going to do. One, two, three, four, five. And the light should change to green. And now we're going to close the door. Thank you for being a part of another successful repair brought to you by AppliancePartsPros.com. For any of your future appliance repair projects, please check out our other videos available on our site, on Facebook, on YouTube, and on Instagram.